lab guy here. We're looking at the power supply for the Iconoscope TV camera. Uh, this represents a major amount of the work in the restoration of the camera. It produces three required voltages used by the Iconoscope camera. The first is called A+, and it's 28 volts DC at 5.5 amps. That's a total of 154 watts of power on the 28 volt power supply. B plus output is plus 405 volts DC at 150 milliamps uh, drawing an additional 61 watts of power. The third output is called C minus and is minus 50 volts DC at less than 10 milliamps and in operation draws less than half a watt. This transformer and this rectifier and a missing capacitor now formed the original 28 volt power supply. That will be replaced by a modern re replacement power supply. This transformer, this rectifier tube, these two filter capacitors and this filter inductor formed the 405 volt power supply. This transformer and two solid state rectifiers beneath the chassis with their own capacitors form the minus 50 volt power supply. This is the original replacement 28 volt power supply that I purchased and it works very well. It is a modern solid state transistorized design modern in the sense that this is 1980s technology has a very large transformer of its own and a filter capacitor but as you can see it's too large to place within this unit even after I remove these parts this is the new switching 28 volt 5.5 amp power supply as you can see it's a lot smaller and it will fit within the volume of this this region here right here and will be the new 28 volt power supply well it's been a few days and I finally uh, put in the uh, 28 volt power supply and uh, cleaned everything up. You see I, I removed that rusty uh, capacitor clamp and uh, covered the uh, hole with a gnarly uh, high voltage sticker. I uh, dusted the chassis off and it looks great. Everything works and so the power supply for the Iconoscope TV camera is now completed.